YouTube Joseph Palmer here. Uh, behind me, I've got a 2001 Toyota Corolla that we're going to be putting a wheel bearing in this rear, the, the left rear, driver rear, and I'm going to show you why. I don't know how well the camera's picking up that noise. You can hear the brake drag a little bit. But there's definitely a noise in that wheel bearing. Now, there's no plate in it. <clears throat> but I did find the noise on the vehicle inspection yesterday, so didn't fail them because in the state of Missouri, if there's no plate, I cannot fail a wheel bearing. But I did recommend that it gets replaced because I can definitely hear noise in it. It's going to start getting play in it. So that's what we're going to do today. While I'm getting everything set up to do that, please do me a favor. Click the subscribe button if you haven't already. We're getting up there close to 800 subscribers. I want to see the uh, subscriber numbers just absolutely take off and... Uh, Really need you guys' help. If you've already subscribed, please click the notification bell. And as always, if you have any questions, drop them in the comments section. I'd be more than happy to answer them for you. And when it's all over with, don't forget to rate the video. Please share it with your friends. And you never know, they might enjoy it. It might help them out. So, give me just a second. We're going to get to tear it into this, guys. I am using a Moog wheel bearing, uh, part number 5120, excuse me, part number 512018. Guys, there you have it. That's all it takes to replace a wheel bearing in one of these cars. Uh, take the wheel off, take the brake drum off, four bolts, pull it out, put the new one in, get everything good and tight. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope it helps some of you guys out. Please don't forget, if you haven't already, hit the subscribe button, rate the video now that it's all over with, share it with your friends. Don't forget to get out there and get your hands dirty, guys. You might just have a little fun doing it. And if you have any questions about it, Throw it in the comment section. I'd be more than happy to try and answer it for you. We'll see you on the next one.